there's exactly two more hours till our vacation is officially over. And I'm very upset. Hi. How many times I told you to not record my chilling times? Two more hours until it's officially over. Finally. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Monday. I'm back home. Getting ready for my first hit. And, well, first hit since I came back. And I'm actually pretty excited. But it will be tough. So, yeah. Two brackets are broken. You know the sun is like behind you guys, so you can't really see your faces, but let me tell you, they're pretty upset. <laughs> yeah, correct. We should, right? And we've been hitting for an hour. Hour ten. Yes. Yeah. And why did my two strings break? Because we are on clay. We woke up at six in the morning. There's still like water on the courts because nobody wakes up this early. And of course my <laughs> rackets broke. What an hero, eh? The only thing <laughs> okay. that I made a mistake, I just brought two for my practice. But usually two is enough. On hard, flat, dry. On clay, humid, and seven o'clock. See, I underestimate enough. how much spin I play with. Yeah. So right. never say I don't use spin. That was okay, the problem. Yeah. You had to play <laughs> okay, yeah. But not to worry. I have rackets coming, and we will finish this practice strong. <laughs> Healthy dinner, pasta with scallops, shrimp. Is this lobster tail? Yeah. With lobster it's... tail. And a salad. And sparkly flavored water. And parmesan cheese. No, Isla, no. No, please don't do that. Why? No, the parmesan cheese and the seafood. Yeah. Says who? I'm Italian guy. Okay. Pretty upset with your tradition. Hey guys, just getting ready for practice and wanted to take a moment. Cruz is here too. Wanted to take a moment and reflect on the year I've had on and off the court now that it's coming to an end and I wanted to say that 2021 definitely felt like a pretty good one for me. Uh, I reached some highlights in my tennis career reaching the quarterfinals of Wimbledon which felt really nice. I always want to do well in the slams and in those 10 days it kind of seemed like all the hard work I put in was worth it. And off the court, I definitely feel like I took some time to enjoy life as well. And, you know, just take my mind off of things when things got heavy with everything going on in the world. At the same time, I felt feel really lucky that I could travel the world and do what I love and have my family and my friends supporting me as always. Going into 2022, I definitely feel like there's still a lot more to be achieved and and I feel motivated to do that, so I'm excited. And maybe if you guys tune in next year into my tennis life, maybe you'll see a little bit more of me and this guy. But you only know if you tune in, so I hope to see you guys. <laughs>